hello this review is tp link smart plug and we review this one and uh, is a wi-fi and you can control anywhere from home to office and remote location is work and you can control with google and any app like you can use with it and also you install the app for casa so you can control through the tp link app so we open and review what is inside so we can set up the network for connect to the wi-fi and i open this one and check what is inside okay okay so what we get inside is a booklet and this is for the connect guide how you connect to so here is a network connection guide so you can connect to the wi-fi through the google app and apple store so download the app from there so i can show you how to download the app and then we can set up the network then we connect to the plug to the router okay thank you so Here is a Google Play Store. Find Casa. And search for Casa Smart Plug and Casa Smart is here. Just click on that. When it's installed, open it. And it asks for you about like the sign in. So if you not have the account, so you have to make the account so you can log into the system. So I'm logging to the my system. So I know I am logging and just wait for a second. And then you are here on the top corner. You just add the device. Click here and it say add the device. So click on add the device and it says ask for the word you have it. So here is the smart plug and it says smart plug as 100 on the top. Just click this one and it say next. So we have to put this is on to the plug. So just wait. So need to take out from here and put on to plug. So see how it works. So I'm just putting on to the plug and it's amber blinking. So means it's ready for setup and is green so powers on so we can click on to the next so so is yellowish and blinking right now amber to green and it shows here to me on here so wait for 15 seconds so it's getting network And after it shows the sign for me, enable location. So I just enable the location and it shows allow. So I just hit the allow button and it's installing the software right now. It's connecting to the device and it take few minutes for connect to the connection. And it shows my network. So I have to enter the information so and after it's connect to the plug enter your network information and just join and after is still connecting to the de device so wait for setup
so choose your device name so I just put S A L O Salo one so I know I just put the name and just click next and wait for here and it save the setting setting is here just save the setting and you are ready to go it's a congratulations so you are configured your smart plug and you are ready to use it for your device list so this is good and sounds good just okay so it's say update now for one more time so it's update so it's a new software installing on the system and then while we check the plug is working or not so we wait for here so it's done for updates so ready to and you can see it shows is green light is connected to Wi-Fi so we test first so I just so you can see this is green and it's working and I connect to this plug to my uh, backup device and it's you see the lights is charging so I come here again and I just click on here green for off so I just click here for off and you can see it's disconnect it's powered off but it's connected to Wi-Fi and my charger is a stop and it's not charging but when I start again one more time click here and you can see the power on and it's work fine and my charger is charging again so thank you guys this is my video for review the smart plug if you like please like and subscribe thank you